This is a video review for a proportional divider, which is a measuring device here that I recently purchased to help me um, with proportions for paintings. Previously, I've used some methods like grids and so forth. Uh, this is superior to those for sure. I, I'm actually kind of sad that it took so long for me to uh, find out about this. I'll link how I found out about this in the description. I just wanted to show how this works and how you can use it in artwork. Um, so my usual process is to look at an iPad while I paint. Basically what you can do with this is uh, it's an adjustable, uh, this is actually made by a company called Accuracy. There are a lot of different manufacturers. This one had the best reviews, so I went with it. It's pretty inexpensive, only $10. Uh, basically how this works is the smaller portion, you measure your original. Just start by measuring the top of the head and then move that over here and make some marks. And then you can measure from the side of the head and do that here. And then from nose to mouth like this and then flip it. So you're just going from small to large uh, to get all your proportions. You make marks and then you fill in the rest of your portrait. And I'll, I'll show that in action here in a bit. You can also adjust the size. So if you slide this more towards the middle and you can just pull on this to release it, adjust it and then snap it back into place, it's really easy. If you move it more towards the middle, uh, it, makes the, it makes these more equal in size. Moving this in this direction, you can do a smaller picture here and a much bigger on this side. So um, there's some adjustability here based on the scale that you're looking for. But it's a really great product. It's held up really well so far, and I found it to be very useful. I've used it in three paintings so far. And this is the measuring tool in action. As you can see, I'm making paint marks as I measure. I've sped this one up, actually. Yeah, it's not real-time speed. But as I measure each facial feature distance, I make a mark. Um, basically just doing this for each major feature of the face um, from the top of the head, sides of the head, inside of the eyes, the nose, to the mouth, to the chin. And then I also in this one did a center grid line and kind of a horizontal grid line between the eyes just based on holding the uh, caliper measuring tool. Um, I found that very effective and useful for kind of gauging these distances without having to eyeball it. And here is a very fast version of the rest of this painting just to give you a sense of how this measuring tool helped me maintain the correct proportions and kind of what the final result looks like using this tool. Again, overall it's a it's a great piece of the toolkit. Um, I'm really glad I purchased this. I'll put some links in the description um, for some more details and so forth, but uh, really a useful product if you want uh, some assistance getting your proportions as accurate as you can without having to spend a, a tedious amount of time on them. So thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, uh, feel free to drop them in the comments.